Good evening, everyone. I'm uh, Deacon Joseph Curtis Jr., Totem Ambassador of Washington, D.C. I'm filling in for uh, Ms. Cheryl Holly this evening. So this evening, we continue with our nine-day novena for Father Augustus Tolton. Today is day six. Tolton, and Tolton Novena for the spiritual welfare of the African-American community. So let us begin by putting on our shield of faith. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Prayer for the canonization of Father Tolton. O oh God, we give you thanks for your servant and priest, Father Augustus Tolton, who labored among us in times of contradiction, times that were, were both beautiful and paradoxical. His ministry helped lay the foundation for a truly Catholic gathering and faith in our time. We stand in the shadow of his ministry. May his life continue to inspire us and embolden us with that confidence and hope that will forge a new evangelization for the church we love. Father in heaven, Father Tolton's suffering service sheds light upon our sorrows. We see them through the prism of your son's passion and death. If it be your will, O oh God, glorify your servant, Father Tolton, by granting the favor I now request through his intercession. So that all may know the goodness of this priest whose memory looms large in the church he loved. Complete what you have begun in us that we might work for the fulfillment of your kingdom, not to us the glory, but glory to you, O God, through Jesus Christ, your Son and our Lord, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. You are our God, living and reigning forever and ever. Amen. For gainful economic opportunities in the African American community. Oh, Father Augustus Tolton who in your ministry came to aid the poor and downtrodden. As we seek your intercession for the spiritual needs of the black community in America, we also come to you asking your prayer for our material needs. Pray Father Tolton, pray Father Tolton for those in our community to have good economic opportunities, to land gainful employment, or to start a business so that all might have the resources needed to provide for themselves, their family, and their church. Pray, Father Tolton, that God might feel in all of us the spirit of a cheerful giver so that we might remember that giving from all that has been given to us will in return be given back to us by the providence of God. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, mother of God, 
Pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh God, we give you thanks for your servant and priest, Father Augustus Tolton, who labored among us in times of contradiction times that were both beautiful and paradoxical. His ministry helped lay the foundation for a truly Catholic gathering and faith in our time. We stand in the shadow of his ministry. May his life continue to inspire us and imbue us with that confidence and hope that will forge a new evangelization for the church we love. Father in heaven, Father Tolton's suffering service sheds light upon our sorrows. We see them through the prism of your son's passion and death. If it be your will, O God, glorify your servant, Father Tolton, by granting the favor I now request through his intercession. So that all may know the goodness of this priest, whose memory looms large in the church he loved. Complete what you have begun, what you have begun in us, that we might work for the fulfillment of your kingdom. Not to us the glory, but glory to you, O God, through Jesus Christ, your Son, and our Lord, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, you are our God, living and reigning forever and ever. Amen. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Thank you for taking part. I see Father Gerard there. Would you like to say something or close us with a blessing, Father? Sure, Deacon. Um, thanks for asking. May Almighty God bless you and keep you. May his face shine upon you, and may he give you his peace. So we ask this blessing from Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you very much, Father. May everyone have a blessed evening. Thank you. <laughs>